To some psychologists, dreams aren't that magical. They're simply a product of our brainwave activity when sleeping. However, other psychologists, such as Sigmund Freud, the founding father of psychoanalysis, and Carl Jung, an early supporter of Freud's theories about the unconscious, believe that dreams come from a deep well within our psyches where we store all our unconscious fears and desires. Whether you agree with Freud, Jung, or other dream experts, delving into the mysteries of dreams is undeniably fun and fascinating. Here are seven types of dreams. 1. Nightmares Have you ever woken up thoroughly relieved that your dream wasn't real? Nightmares can haunt us if we believe our fears are greater than our power to overcome them. For example, if you have anxiety or depression, you're prone to having more nightmares than pleasant dreams. Researchers have also discovered that those who have frequent nightmares are often suicidal, struggle with trauma from toxic relationships, or have a family history of mental disorders. 2. Lucid dreams Have you ever been aware that you're dreaming while dreaming? Since you're in control, it can make your dream a lot more interesting. You can take advantage of the situation and do exciting things you wouldn't be able to do in real life, be it flying on a broomstick or catching a shooting star. Lucid dreaming allows you to experience the impossible. 3. Healing dreams Healing dreams offer insight into your health. I often used to dream about being in grimy bathrooms. Looking back, I think those dreams were a reminder to look after myself better. Now that I began a healthier diet and started to exercise more, those dreams have reduced significantly. Often, our problems manifest themselves in our dream settings. So, pay close attention to your surroundings the next time you dream. 4. Recurring dreams Do you ever repeat the same dreams over and over again? Recurring dreams try to communicate something important that we're ignoring or somehow failing to notice. To understand them better, try to be more observant the next time it occurs. Paying attention to any overlapping themes and the actions you take will help break the cycle in both your dreams and reality. 5. Physiological dreams Physiological dreams show us what our bodies are lacking. For instance, dreaming about drinking water might indicate that you're dehydrated. Physiological dreams are often pretty straightforward and easy to interpret upon waking up. When you're not meeting your body's most basic needs, it will communicate that through physiological dreams. 6. Psychic dreams These dreams are also known as prophetic dreams. Something in your dream occurs that, soon after, materializes in real life. As a child, I would get these dreams a lot. I believed I had access to a world no one knew about. But as I got older, they became less frequent. Some dream experts believe that our minds can sense what is going to happen before actually making sense of the information. 7. Epic Dreams Epic dreams are the life-changing dreams we have that help us go through big transformations. Oftentimes, these dreams affect us deeply and we vividly remember the details. I had one recently where I dreamt of my best friend who had passed away. He acted like his usual goofy self and I realized he came to say goodbye. Deep down, I think I wanted closure. We meant to hang out one day, but he had an unexpected visitor that postponed our plans. I never did get to see him again. As a matter of fact, he's the reason I had the courage to pursue this career. Lately, I've been facing tremendous changes in my life, so it's been overwhelming. But seeing him again in my dream reminded me to keep pushing. I hope you have the courage to go through epic transformations too. What kind of dreams do you normally have? If you have a special topic request you'd like us to explore next, let us know below. Be sure to subscribe to our channel as well for more helpful tips and share this video with others. With your help, we can reach more people to spread awareness on the mind and mental health issues. Thanks so much for watching!